Hi, I'm Paul Atoll from PaulAtoll.com and tonight I'm going to show you uh, that uh, Far Cry 2 works uh, for the Mac. Uh, first of all, this is my website uh, with all kind of cool games. You got even a dust section now. And, um, well, uh, games what I have ported are, um, well, well, it's like uh, FIBA 11 and Call of Duty and Medal of Honor and Let's Command and Conquer, Commandos, Need for Speed, blah 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 blah. Anyway, um, well, tonight we're gonna do a Far Cry 2. And, um, well, let's start with it. Um, well, I put it already on the, on the website. So you, you have to click here. And then uh, we can choose for a download wrapper here, and you would download, uh, as you can see here, you would download the, the rep file. Well, download it, extract it, and you get uh, this file. Um, if you double click it, you're going to click install Windows software. And then you put a DVD or an image of uh, Far Cry 2 in a drive, um, which you bought uh, legally, of course. Well, then uh, you're going to install uh, this game by using a setup.exe. You click in, uh, in the installation. Well, go next. Accept. Next. Easy install. Well, this will take a while, so be back in a second. Well, then it starts with Punk Buster installation. Well, you see here it gives an error with the identity check. Well, what I already said in the in the on the website uh, on the section of uh, of uh, Far Cry 2 that the Punk Buster uh, well it doesn't work. So if you do multiplayer, you should do uh, non Punk Buster uh, servers. So um, I'll click OK and then we click this away. You're going to cancel, you say yes, and then it will update uh, runtime and direct digs and stuff like that. Well, we will just wait uh, till it's finished. Well, I think it uh, should be uh, finished about that. You click yes. And then you have to set the main X file. Well, for me, the install will probably crash at the end. It's not a big deal. Yeah, you see. Crash, but you just click uh, open again. Then I go to advanced, and I go to browse, and I go to program files, and I go to Ubisoft, and I go to Far Cry 2, and I go to bin, and then I go to the Far Cry 2 X file, and I click choose, and then done. Well, now the X file is set, but we are not there yet. Um, this game uh, contains uh, a DRM, and um, well, uh, Wine uh, doesn't handle. Uh, oops, does not does not uh, you have to do. No. Um, it has a kind of DRM, but uh, Wine uh, can't uh, open yet. So um, we we need a no CD patch, or we can't even uh, play this game. So we show uh, package content, that's so C, program files, Ubisoft, Far Cry 2, we go to bin, and then we're gonna replace the main X file by an OCD patch. This is needed because otherwise you can't even play this game, and that would be uh, quite a pity even if you bought this game. So um, yeah, that's why we need an OCD patch to play it. All right, well, everything is set now. All right, and what I'm gonna tell you now is that um, the first time you're gonna uh, 
uh, going to start this game, you can't change resolution yet. It will take a, a standard resolution like a 1280 and then 1080 or something, or 12, whatever. Um, so um, if you um, want to use that, it's fine, but it will probably, uh, well, will not be so smooth if you do uh, 1024 and 768. Well, uh, you have to change that uh, after restarting the game. Uh, I'm going to show you that in a second. Well, let's, I'm going to start it. Uh, you probably see it uh, not full screen now. You will see probably it in the corner because ScreenFlow does handle screen resolution changes very well. So, well, um, you will see it full screen uh, and I see it full screen. But in the video, because of ScreenFlow, you, you, doesn't, you don't see it um, proper. But if you do it yourself, you see you will see that it works all fine. Uh, nice. All right, you can uh, play story mode. Um, I go to um, to options, okay, display. Well, you see, it's uh, it's set to thousand twenty four seven sixty eight. The reason why is that. Um, um, well, I installed this game earlier, and uh, the game already made a profile of what I uh, what um, uh, yeah about uh, what settings I uh, chose. So your setting would probably uh, 1280,024 uh, or something like that. Well, I had it. Uh, you probably had it. it. Will have the same or something else. Um, so uh, you can change this at the moment. So after, um, uh, well, after starting this once, you will have to exit the game and then restart the game again. And then you can choose or uh, change the resolution to the one uh, you want to play. Well, I have a thousand to a That's fine with me. Um, well, you can. Uh, I'll change uh, this play stuff uh, on the thing you uh, want. I put it all low. Uh, reason why is then it uh, runs very smooth uh, for me. So I'll show you in a second. And I go uh, right away to another point of the game. Not the intro because uh, yeah, you would drive in a car, in a jeep, and it takes a lot of time. So I go straight away to some action. And then you'll see how uh, smooth it runs. Well, let's go to the story mode. And then we're gonna load a game. And I'm gonna do it. Let's see. Up here. Load. Well, it goes quite smooth. I'll show you in a second. Come on, asshole. Let's go. Oh, Never mind, man. man. I'm not gonna find one. an invalid. That's a bad case of malaria you got. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Don't follow me. Hey, if you make it out of here alive and you see me at Mike's bar, maybe I can get some pills for a coffee. Yet. Evaluation of you. Guys that do good work for me get paid. Come on back up to the fishing pair and I'll cash you out.
works, but it's fine. Anyway, um, well, um, yeah, yeah, accept. Bye bye. <clears throat> Well, as you can see, it uh, runs uh, fine. So, um, well, have uh, fun with this game. And, um, well, see you back on Polotol.com. Tell your friends. And, um, well, um, if you love the work I do, you can always donate on my website. If you want to support my work, you can be a FIP member. If you are a FIP member, then um, you've got some special features. You can have, so you can, uh, your uh, request will be priority. And he gets uh, two uh, great games like uh, Command and Conquer Tiberian Dawn and uh, Hidden Dangerous. And um, of course, you help the work of, uh, yeah, of uh, maintaining his website and, uh, well, all the stuff I was uh, looking around to that. So, um, well, thank you for watching and uh, see you back on Polotol. Uh, bye bye.